Alright Brad's here today, today we're going to be counting down the top of 5 best MCP servers of all time, of course for the brand new updated Minecraft 1.14.60, soon about to be 1.16 aka the nether update. In this video I will be showcasing a faction server, skyward server, a UAT server, murder mystery etc. This basically has everything. I know most of you guys are in quarantine right now and you want something good to do, something fun to do now that school is about to end and these servers should provide you with loads of hours of non-stop fun. So without further ado guys, let's head on to the number 5 spot. So we're starting things really strong with a UHC server. Believe it or not, this server actually does have UHC. I will be showcasing it in this video, but this is the server IP and the port. So the IP is mc.bedrockplay.eu and the port is simply default 19132. Now, anyways guys, once you have the IP and the port exactly the way I have it, feel free to log on to the server. So when you load into the server, you should be greeted by this amazing looking lobby. There's just so much going on but anyways we're just gonna go to the NPC so we have Skywars but right over here and over here we have the bridge which is another highly underrated game it's from Hypixel so that's really cool we also have Egg Wars another underrated game and the best one of all the UHC so here is the UHC I know many of you guys have been begging me for UHC servers constantly and I decided to why not deliver over here we have access to the survival minigame and over here it is the murder mystery personally my favorite one is the UHC but don't worry guys all of these other minigames are super polished and super Super well as well and there's also annihilation right over here which is a brand new minigame it is still in the beta guys and over here is the duels that is coming really soon so this server is constantly you know making so many improvements and it's actually rather new there's a lot of players online so you'll never be lonely and it's actually a good place to make some friends but anyways i'm just gonna go to the uhc and i'll show you guys what you can do here is the UHC, we're just going to hit it on tap to play and we actually have two options. We can do a UHC solos right over here or we can do a duo. Don't get confused, I know it looks like a 1v1 but it's not a 1v1 UHC, it is a free for all UHC, that's what it's supposed to mean. And over here this is supposed to mean duos, not a 2v2 so just once again don't get mixed up with that. And we're going to do with duos for now because there seems to be more players in it. So this is a full on legit UHC guys, so I'll be back with you guys once the game has started. Alright boys, so here we are fully in the game. Now for those of you who are unfamiliar with UHC, it is supposed to represent ultra hardcore mode. Basically, you're given 30 minutes to get a bunch of resources by either mining or up here in the surface. And after a while, you will get teleported to all the rest of the players and there you will fight. Now, unfortunately, I have not been able to find any type of cave, but hopefully my teammate does. But anyways guys, that's pretty much it for the number 5 spot. Let's head on to the number four spot at the number four spot we have a sky block server now this server name is imperial so the ip to the server is play.imperials.net and the port is simply default 19132 so anyways guys make sure you save the ip and the port exactly the way i have it feel free to write it down on a piece of paper save it to your device notes just make sure you have it exactly the way i do and once you're done with that you can hit on save and you can join the server and i'll basically show you guys how to actually make an island so when you spawn into the server, you should be greeted by this rather nice looking lobby right over here. We have a bunch of crates over there, so if you're interested in that. And there's actually a massive PvP arena. So if you're getting a little bit tired of the traditional skybook, then of course you can get a refresher by of course PvPing. So feel free to do that. Anyways guys, it is super easy to create an island. All you want to do is type in slash is just like so and it will pop up for you right over here. You'll get a bunch of options so you can actually join an island. If your friend has an island, they can invite you. You can also also look at the top islands in the server and of course there is a public open islands for you to join but I'm gonna be creating my own island for this video just like so if you actually have a special rank on the server then you can pick different types of sky blocks but since we don't have any rank this is our only option so we're just gonna press on destroyed outpost right over here then we're going to press on create just like so and we should be teleported to our sky block right over here now here is the starter tools that you will get you'll get a bunch of these stuff right up here so you will get some lava you'll get some ice some bone meal some pumpkin seeds melon seeds and of course an oak sapling now i'm actually really bad at skyblock so i will need your guys's help so if you want to join my skyblock then feel free to leave your game attack in the comment section down below and whenever i have the time i will add you to my skyblock and we can make the best skyblock ever if you're gonna own an island you will obviously need to know how to properly manage it now that is super easy you can go over here and type in slash is just like so and it will give you an option to manage your island right over here down here where it says manage your island feel free to do that and then over here you can go kick a player you can promote people disband the group or give ownership of your island it is literally up to you you can do anything in in this server so that's why i absolutely love it but anyways guys that is pretty much it for the number four spot 
Let's head on to the number three spot. Uh, we have Nexus PE right over here. Now the IP to the server is hub.nexuspe.net and the port is simply default 199132. Now this is actually a faction server. If you're not so sure how faction works, it is basically gangs versus gangs where basically you and a bunch of your friends can go up against a bunch of other groups on the server. And once you have the IP exactly the way I have it, feel free to join the server. So when you actually join the server, you should be greeted by this amazing looking lobby right over here. And if you actually go on the compass right up here, over here, you should be able to select what type of factions you want to join. So we have OP factions, Sky factions, and there's even a special event. Every now and then, this server will host some type of event, like it could be like a sumo event or a massive PvP FFA. I think it's really cool how this server actually does do events. Now, OP factions is way more popular than Sky factions, so we're gonna quickly join that one. So this is the OP factions area right over here and there's a bunch of cool stuff you can do. Uh, it actually does give you the information to the store and a place where you can vote for certain things about this server. So currently they're on season 6 right now. So in order to make your own factions it is super easy. All you want to do is type in slash faction create just like so. Faction create and then you want to type in the name of it. So I think we're going to be making our own factions for this video. So if you want to join my factions make sure to leave your game attack in the comment section down below. You can also join uh, some other faction that you might get invited to. So I'm just going to call this one the French Fries, just like so. There you go. It said that our faction is successfully created, guys. If you actually want a whole list of the commands that you can use in the server, it is super easy to actually look at all the commands. All you have to do is type in slash faction help one, just like so, faction help one, and it should give you a list of commands that you will need. For example, if you want to ally with the factions and do slash faction ally and just a bunch of other cool stuff. All right, guys, but if you do slash faction help a two you should get even more commands that you will be able to use so in order to get a starter kit all you want to do is type in slash kit just like so and over here you can pick between all of these different kinds of kits i'm just going to start with the starter kit just like so we got the starter kit equipped and it basically includes all of this good stuff which is pretty good for a starter kit we have all of this stuff but if you want to actually go to the wild and officially start your factions all you want to do is type in slash a wild just like so once you finish doing that then hit on a next just like so and it should teleport you to a random location on the map but anyways guys that is pretty much it for the number three spot let's head on to the number two spot on the number two spot, we have a server that is kind of like Hypixel, but for Minecraft Bedrock Edition. That is, of course, Hyperlands. Now, the IP to the server is hyperlandsmc.net, and the port is simply default 19132. So once you're done typing that in, you can officially join the server. And this is really good because this also has UHC as well. However, it is UHC meetup, which I guess can still technically count as a UHC. Well, this server is well known for being the Hypixel of Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So that's how you know that this server is legit they took this lobby straight from the high pixel java edition and they put it on to the bedrock edition which is pretty cool you know this is like the closest we'll get to a high pixel experience but anyways if we go over here to where it says play we will get access to a bunch of mini games so over here we have the traditional solo skywards right here all of these are high pixel maps guys they take it straight from high pixel and they use it on the server so you know what that is pretty cool like i said this is the closest you will get to like a high pixel experience and over here you can join a pe only lobby say for example if there's just like like too many Windows 10 players and you're on your mobile device and you're tired of like losing to all these Windows 10 tryhards then you can actually go to the PE lobby and over there you'll be with players who are on their mobile devices the pet shop and the shop right over here where you can go buy kits and all of that and there's also a soul well right up there so if you're interested in that feel free to go check that out there's also some duels but over here we have the prototype lobby now the prototype lobby is completely separate from this lobby it is basically like the second lobby where it'll give you access to these games right here we have better wars UHC meetup and the bridge so this server is the full deal guys so we're just gonna go over here and we're gonna check all of them out there's also better wars solos right up here and there's also better wars doubles that means a teams of two over here is where you can join the UHC meetup and the bridge which is another extremely underrated game that is up from hypixel there is also a youtube rank on this server so if you have over a thousand subscribers feel free to make some content in this server because you will be rewarded by a lot of special ranks like youtube rank and the YouTube rank will give you access to a whole lot of cosmetics and of course different types of kits that you can use. Anyways guys that is pretty much it for the number two spot. 
Let's head on to the number one spot. The number one spot, guys, we have a broken lens right over here. One of the most phenomenal servers in all of Minecraft. I'm not even sure why it's not in the featured server list, but this definitely deserves to be in it. There's dozens and dozens of games. But anyways, the IP is a play.brlns.net, and the port is simply default once again, 19132. So just make sure you save the information exactly the way I have it. Then you can feel free to join the server, and I'll basically showcase every Every single mini game this server has to offer so when you join a broken lens you should be greeted by this amazing looking lobby which is really cool you can go over here and just explore a bunch of cool stuff so guys the next step to do in order to access all of these games is simply press on the orange die and over here it should give you a list of all the mini games this server has to offer so we have sky wars survival games one of the chamber tnt tag a team sky wars hide and seek both sleep TNT Run, Block Party, Quake Craft, The Best Builder, Micro Battles, Drawn Gas, Tag Hunters, Splatter, Murder Mystery, Team Survival Games, A Team Quake Craft, The Best Builders, and Mob Wars. So as you can tell, there is literally a whole lot of mini games that this server has to offer, which is pretty cool. And not only that, but this is also a Java Edition server. So if you have Java and Bedrock Edition, then you can actually use the server on a both versions. So that is another massive plus. I think this is like the only server that actually does that. Honestly, in my honest opinion, this server is better than the Hive. So that's how you know that this is absolutely legit. And I think we're gonna be joining, uh, I think we're gonna be joining Block Party because we don't play Block Party that much. All right, so once you tapped on the game you want to play, go over here to this NPC that says Quick Play. Tap on that just like so and you should be teleported over here. And now all you have to do is wait a couple minutes until the game starts and you should be good. And another massive plus about this server is the amount of players that are on. There is constantly at least 2,000 players on this server so you'll literally never ever get lonely. And of course, this is not going to be like a ghost town. Right, so the game is starting and the reason why I joined this is I just wanted to show you how like unique all of these games are compared to like the rest of these servers. So this is why it is on the number one spot. And Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If this video did help you out in any way, shape, or form, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, make sure to follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter for more updates on my life. Tell me in the comment section down below which one of these servers was your favorite. Personally, for me, it has to be Broken Lens. Anyways guys, please like, comment, and subscribe. Stay safe everyone. See you later, french fries.